Hey everyone, Son of Beast here, and I'm Wood Spoonie, and this is NBA 2K24 on 2K Sports. Hello everyone, Wood Spoonie, and Son of Beast here. Welcome back to another NBA on 2K Sports. This next matchup we're about to be seeing the Central Division Showdown. It's between the two states of the border that are coming in near, as we're about to be seeing the Milwaukee Bucks and Chicago Bulls. The toughest and greatest rival matchup between the best player of the Bulls of Michael Jordan and to the greatest legend of all, the superstar legendary of Giannis Antetokounmpo. Now this is what the team looks for. They have been on a great run. They already won each game and back on the winning streak. But one season was determined to be the loss against the Minnesota Wolves. This was not close at all to go from next to the state. But there's going to be a narrow way that they can try to keep back into a game. Well, we might be seeing how if the Chicago Bulls win the game, then they can take out with the second loss of the Bucks. If they win, then they beat against the Bulls and they're on the crushing run of the season for the clutch run. After the last season victory against the Samantha Sabonis' team of the Sacramento Kings, as you already have seen how well they've done. And now for this time, let's meet your starting lineups, starting with Milwaukee Bucks. Damian Lillard, Malik Beasley, Chris Middleton, Giannis Antetokounmpo, the Greek Freak, and Brooke Lopez. Now it's time to meet your Chicago Bears, the veteran of the North Carolina, Kobe White, Zach Levine, DeMar DeRozan, Patrick Williams, and Nikola Vucevic. These are your starting fives in between Milwaukee and Chicago. Now it's time to take you down to United Center. Standing by is Kevin Harlan, along with Clark Kellogg and David Aldridge. We'll be back with the post game show right after this. We'll see you all later after this one. As for halftime coming up, it's all for everything. Irving Johnson, Cutting to Chuck Smith, and Shag Donia. Standing by, we'll be covering up for Will It Be All for Everything. We'll be cool base, and the other side, we all call for one, Tally Cruz. See you guys later after this. Enjoy the next game of Game 12 of the NBA 2K Sports. 2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. And getting mentally prepared to compete. You see the focus. You feel the energy. These guys are ready to go. Welcome everyone. Thanks for tuning in to 2K Sports for this NBA presentation. We'll watch the Chicago Bulls in this one as they go up against the Milwaukee Bucks. With Brett Barry and Greg Anthony, this is Kevin Harlan, and David Aldridge will be joining us on the sideline as well. Here are the starters for Milwaukee. Lopez is the pivot with Giannis to his side. Beasley on the wing along with Middleton. And it's Lillard in at the one spot. And for the Bulls, star pair of Levine and DeRozan are your wingmen. Rojevich is the pivot. Williams is in the other post spot. And it's White in at the point. Here in the middle of the season, injuries can certainly pile up. Greg, how does a team hold it together when it's, when it's missing important pieces? Kevin, it's all about communication and, and being ready to step up. As long as you keep working as a unit, you can cover for missing bodies. And here's Williams now. He'll bring it up for Chicago. As to White. Vucevic trying to get over, and it's White missing. DeRozan against Middleton. It's Beasley on the wing. The Bucks keep it going. A new 14-second clock goes back up. 
Milwaukee, no good that time either. And the Bulls with possession. Here's Williams. And the reach! Out of bounds. Bulls ball. White finds DeRozan. That's the third straight miss to start this game, and they're still looking for their first basket. Picks it down to Middleton. They get the rebound over DeRozan. The putback. Giannis on the group And Giannis throwing his body in there and gets rewarded. Outside Williams. At DeWine. DeRozan for three. And the rebound goes to Lopez. That's 0 for 4 now. Time to slow it down and maybe get the best possible shot the next time down. Lillard against White. Lillard attacking. Vucevic with the block. Well timed by Vucevic. Not a sitter who piles up blocks, but this guy picks his spot. Lillard, hey, DeRozan. After missing their first four shots. One of five, not what they wanted, but they're on the board. And what a stretch it's been, Brent, for this Milwaukee franchise. All started by the drafting of Giannis Antetokounmpo. Well, just identifying him is one thing, Kevin. you got to also acknowledge the work that Giannis has put in. After that, they have done a great job of building around him. Had that not been the case... Kobe! What? He would have re-upped and signed that extension with the Bucks to continue his career here, what would have happened in free agency? Middleton, played in with the first Middleton. Middleton. Inside, Middleton. Timeout, Chicago Bulls. In the paint. So timeout called here, the first for Chicago. Coming into this, having notched a win against the Rockets in their last game. Yeah, in that game, the offense was firing on all cylinders. Partly because the other team's defense was a no-show. Yeah, with the defense struggling like that, I think they just stayed with a healthy, consistent pace to get that win. Got a couple feelings about this one. You know, the Chicago Bulls are one of the best. But tell you what, it's all what happens. Kobe White is always in the player inbound from the University of North Carolina with the Tar Heels that have been playing here back in 2019 of the season. And right now, he's looking for himself to keep on going. He's one of the biggest guys that might be one of his favorite best players. Well, as you may already know, it's what happens right now. Back to Kevin Arlen. And now the 2K leaderboard. A list of the teams that have rebounded the ball tremendously over the last 10 games. Number five, the Bulls. What a show of strength in terms of rebounding. I mean, they've really controlled the glass here of late. Playing with some extreme physicality. White against Lillard. Williams passes to Levine. Back to Williams. And the rejection by Giannis. Beasley kicks to Lillard. The Damian Lillard. He passed me. Well, he's a score first kind of guy, Lillard. You want to construct your defense to try and swarm him to contain him when he has the ball. And Vooch said, Larry! Big Lillard, you see that. Tom Kobe White. To defend. And Beasley has the ball here for Milwaukee. Pass to Lopez. Kicks to Lillard. Back to Lopez. Beautiful day. Lopez. 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 Lopez was powering through that time. So they mean the here. On the wing, Williams. Back to White. Kobe! What? Nice job here early of a staff. Uh, Patrick Williams. Milwaukee has gone 0 3 from three point land. Nothing yet going outside. And two free throws coming Bulls up. Bulls on the front. The order goes in. This is first possible shot. For a seed. A very dogged defender. Shooting, Shooting from Milwaukee. He's a champion. Chris Middleton. It's his uh, line for two shots. 84 is a really good number to post at the foul line, and that's where he's at on the year. Oh, 
Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And that one falls for Middleton. He's so the the board of Chicago Bulls. Number three, Andre Drummond. And it's Alex Caruso. And number nine. And number six, Alex Caruso. Off on that one, so he goes one for two at the one. They've been beating him to a lot of those loose balls and rebounds here this summer. Andre Drummond. The end one. Foul on Milwaukee, and it's number six, not like Beasley. The scoring breakdown for his first foul. And right from the jump, he's first. He's hard to establish themselves inside using the two. The line is you got a bull. Andre Drummond. Passing that they displayed at the shooting wall. Great ball movement that's opening up some chances without really getting deep into the execution. On the free throw, no good. The Bucks trail. And now, here comes Arna Kumbo, leading the break. No good from Covington. Out to the right wing. Caruso finds Drummond. Outside, White. For three. They get it back. And he uses Andre Drummond. Drummond's got his second bucket of the game to go. That makes it 10 of their last 12 coming from inside the paint. Lillard looking around. Good on the triple. Damian yeah, Lillard. Lillard's got First three. Three great shots from Lillard. He loves finding space around that perimeter so he can just fire. And now a veteran in the NBA. You get the feeling every season is important to Dane Lillard. But they get the feeling great. Oh, that's a foul on the Chicago Bulls. That's the first course, though. In competitive basketball late. In New substitution for the Chicago Bulls. Number 12. Ayo Dosumu. Catching up on the changes for Chicago. Dosumu comes in for Levine. And it's Carter in for Kobe White. The Bucks also with the sub. Oh, Jams checked in. Hill, baby, and Dean Willard with tremendous confidence. Timeout, Chicago Bulls. And now called the Bulls. Well, whether things are good, bad, or indifferent, coaches will have adjustments to make throughout the course of the game. Yeah, not just there to pump up or to discipline players. you got to make sure that the coach makes the proper adjustments and has his team in the right mindset to carry it out. Now, they're not even just approval enough, and watch out at that point. You know, it's because of the, the dynamic duo players in between of one of Damian Lillard and Regiannis Anacumbo, they've always been the best one to take. Well, they got to do something else about it, and you know, it's not going to be that easy, but to tell them that, it's a lot of hard maintaining it and just the proper to take care of it. They've got to do something else about it, so they got to watch out for that one in between. We're almost two minutes in right now in the first period. Let's get you back to Kevin Harlan. And here's a look at some numbers for Kobe White. The Bulls have gone 6 and 12 from the field here in the first quarter. And there's two minutes remaining in the first period. Two minutes. Two minutes. Hunter on the wing, covered by Lillard. Some nice ball movement by the Bulls. Caruso, the pass to Drummond. Down to five on the shot clock. And it's Carter missing. Milwaukee in the lead. Here's Lillard. Good. Damian Lillard. Get up the assist. Jeremy Honest on the Kubo. Oh man, this would be a different ball game if they didn't have this type of scoring to rely on. And Drummond kicks to Carter. Back to Drummond. Pass to DeRozan. There's 117 left to play in the first quarter. Here are DeRozan! And this is DeRozan's go-to. And he remains such an outstanding threat from the mid-ring. Lillard up top, defended by Carter. Lillard, the pass to Bochamp. 
Carter pulls it in. And so it's Carter who brings the ball up for Chicago. Trailing by two. And DeRozan kicks to Carter. Here's Caruso. It's three pointers off the mark. The Bucks have gotten seven out of their first 16 field goal attempts to go down here in the first. Connaughton against Caruso. And that one's good from Connaughton. Not Connaughton. And that's just showing off right there, guys. I mean, he is too good with that crossover. The shot and game clock separated by four. Carter on the wing, covered by Lillard. And the best. DeMar DeRozan! Six points for DeMar DeRozan. And he is playing and scoring with confidence. Here's Yacht. No good there with this step back chain. You know, they don't score on that shot, but they're pretty happy. And uh, that's the end of the first quarter. And so Milwaukee Bucks, 18, and Chicago Bulls, 16. In the quarter, the D is having all sorts of problems with it. And we'll be right back after this. Close game in between, but we'll keep your eyes shortly after this. And we hope you're enjoying the game. Both teams tonight keeping things pretty even so far in the scoreboard. When you consider how the Bucks are doing, what do you guys think? You know, I like the confidence that they've shown here early on. Yeah, I think they've controlled the momentum, and that is showing up. You know, Brent, I heard you talking the other day about the advantage left-handed players have in drawing fouls. Why do you feel that's the case? I just always felt, Kevin, that you don't really prepare for lefties. You don't see many of them in the league. So think about it. On a Monday and a Wednesday, you're playing a squad, and all of a sudden, Thursday's back-to-back -back game has a guy like James Harden. It's just hard to adjust. Nikolai Drusevich! Defending a left-handed player. Kobe White. Lillard on the bench. This is who Adrian Griffin has out there. They've got Cameron Payne. Portis is out there with Chris Middleton. Then it's Malik Beasley. And it's Bochamp in at the three spot. Now here's Middleton. Pass to Bochamp. Nice again. And it's laid up and in. Where's Middleton? Middleton's got five points so far. They're getting on a roll inside. The last three field goals have come from the paint. Vucevic finds Levine. Vucevic with it. Williams with the ball. Scoreless thus far. A moment now to hear from our sideline reporter, Hall of Famer, David Alton. David. Thank you, Kevin. Chris Middleton is a huge part of the Bucks' offensive attack. Thomas says we need him to be aggressive, taking over games. And asked whether down the stretch. Three pointers! Zach Levine! He's got a depth. If he wants the ball, he gets it. Simple as that. Kevin? You're so right, David. The trust factor is definitely there. Hey, thanks for the report. And here's Middleton after the three pointer from Zach Levine. Middleton with it. Williams picks him up. Six to shoot. Floats one up. And it's Chicago with the rebound. Now for him, it's harder to miss that shot than it is to make that shot. I think he was anticipating a bit of a bump there. Back to Vucevic. On the wing, Williams. Here's White. Beasley with the rebound. Probably not the shot that was drawn up for that possession, but he can't pass it up, and he can't knock it down. And here in the second quarter of action with a hair under two and a half. Out of bounds. Milwaukee basketball. Uh, they say it was last touched by Vucevic. Vucevic. 
Nikolov, who's he bet? Well, they're trying to take command of this game, but it's been competitive so far. Yeah, everybody trying to get away from one another, and the threads are keeping them close. This has been highly competitive. Now, here's Payne. No scoring in this one. Foul in the hole. In a chance now to win. Patrick Williams. Jay's first for score five. Payne's first. Draymond Green and the Golden State Board. Shooting the Milwaukee. They'll begin a road Chris Middleton, San Antonio, and line up against two shots. And, and Kevin, I think you have to look at this as an opportunity to take a step forward. Sometimes tough road trips right. can take bring right. the best out of a Kiss team up. and bring you closer together. That free throw, no good. Now, you say that Chris Middleton is definitely that guy, but just be mindful that it's a careful idea, but you may be thinking what happens because how much he does, he's been training a lot with Giannis Antetokounmpo. Might be his, one I'm talking guy you know. He hits the second from the lock. For Chicago, they've gone three of their first five shots to drop here in the second quarter. Caruso looking for an opening. Back to Levine. Over Beasley. And the ball. Zach Ruby! On the interior. Levine really crafty at figuring out ways to create space down low. Williams against Middleton. Nice D from Williams. This is a rough stretch right here for him offensively. Seems to be rushing shots. He kicks to Vucevic. Back to Williams. Some nice ball movement by the Bulls. Three pointer, Kobe White. Continue to grow. They're way ahead in that category. Ball movement. Timeout, Milwaukee Bucks. And Milwaukee calls their first time out of the game. This game coming after a loss against the Jets. Yeah, a snowball effect in that one. One thing will go wrong, then another, then another. Really, the story of the game. Yeah, it felt like just the entire roster was stuck in neutral. There was nobody offensively that could get anything going. In just a few more minutes, we will have the halftime show. As right now, it will be Irving Johnson, Shaq O'Neal, and Kenny Jet Smith. That will be here to coming up here for the first half of the game for our halftime show. You know, I'm really, really seeing what's going on right now. If there is an upset right now, it's going to be a lot of tough chance to just keep on shooting again. Well, there may be one change, but we'll find out how this is going to happen right now. Yeah, totally true. Might be one thing you can't tell. We'll get to the 30 second mark and then come back after this. All right, Billy Donovan may be looking for any day. Let's get back into work. New substitutional change on the offense. For Patrick Williams. Tamar DeRozan comes in for Alex Caruso. Ayo Dosubu is checked in for Zach Levine. And it's Damian Lewis. Big group substitution here for Milwaukee. Brooke Lopez is checked in for Bobby Portis. Antetokounmpo comes in for Chris Middleton. Pat Connaughton, he's checked in for Malik Beasley. And Lillard subbed in for Payne. Here's DeRozan. Following the score by Damian Lillard. Count it. Damar DeRozan. Now for the Bulls. A much better quarter for them shooting the ball. That's a two from Lillard. And it's Chicago with the rebound. Vucevic has got his fourth rebound in this one. Pass to Drummond. There's the three. And three. Point basket, Jamar and Rose. Point Bulls lead. Andre Drummond with the assist. For a big man like Andre Drummond, he can make those kind of plays. Lillard finds defense. Defense. Here's Bochamp. Jerome's defending. Bochamp misses. Chicago with the ball. We're under two and minutes remaining in the period. Two to the paint. I bet it is good. Larry Bishop. For him, one for four shoes. This for uh, Damian Lillard. It's sometimes about how gifted Lillard is as a passing guard. You want him running your point. Grant, don't you love that 
team player Giannis is a star with very little ego. The things Frankie does so well is deflect everything or reflect everything back to him. It's about him. He'll compliment his teammates. And Damian Lillard for three points team is from Giannis on the Gumpo. You know, Lillard works so hard on the offensive end of the floor. It's really what helps him get going like this. The pass to Dosun. Vucevic against Giannis. Drummond. And he can't answer back. The three-pointer offline. Bucks trail by three. Passes to Bochamp. Good, and the assist goes. The Bochamp. Bochamp assist to draw. This quarter. Giannis on the cool the best there is in the business when it comes to making that lead pass. Now here's DeRozan. We had 19 points in the win. Three boy basket. Ayo Decimo. Bernie Mario Rose. Vucevic against Omnicumbo. Five on the clock. Great team that time for Vucevic. I thought he was making that in so close. That's a and that's it for your first half of the period. Chicago Bulls, 36. And Milwaukee Bucks, 32. Standing by courtside. David. Thanks very much, Billy. I heard you tell the guys to take it to them and play with more physicality offensively. What did you mean? Just I think when we're getting the ball inside around the basket at times, we got to go up a little bit stronger and play through the contact and go to the rim. Tough sledding in there, but we got to get there. Thanks, Coach. Appreciate it. Back to you. Thanks for the great interview, David. And we'll be back for the third quarter of basketball following halftime. The TGK Sports Halftime Show. Hey, everybody. Good to see you back here on our halftime show. Well, actually, we can't see you, but you can see us, but you get it. Ernie Johnson, Kenny the Jet Smith, Shaquille O'Neal. You're watching the NBA on 2K Sports. It was a closely contested first quarter for Chicago. In the first period, their biggest lead was a slim three points. They had a very good second quarter, currently holding a four-point advantage at halftime. And Kenny, what did you think about what you saw from Chicago? They came in prepared. The offense is firing on all levels. We love the pace, the flow. Very efficient. Value and possessions is fueling their success right now. This is not a team you want to bet At least not tonight. And Shaq, what do you think about Milwaukee? Well, their strategy to kind of decided to work well so far. I wouldn't get away from it if I was drawing up the second half plan. Uh, keep working to the post, and you got to win that physical battle. And that does it for our halftime show. We now take you back to Kevin Harlan for the start of the third period. You've been watching the 2K Sports Halftime Show. All right, let's get back into the United Center. I can have a basketball upon us. We may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game it's been so far. Really an incredible game from Lillard. Definitely been challenging the defense here early on, not settling for anything outside. And you want these kind of nights where you can start to see those openings before they happen. And in that first half, we saw a pretty tight battle. We'll soon find out what sort of adjustments were discussed during the half. We'll see DeRozan and Williams playing it forward. The guard set is White alongside Levine. And it's Vucevic in at the five side. So that's the five in the game for Chicago. But the side, the For taking that initiative on offense. I love seeing this mindset. Lopez finds Lillard with the shot. Chicago grabs the miss. Vucevic has got rebound number seven for him tonight. It's White on the wing. By Lillard, and it's White missing. And here's Middleton bringing it up now for the Milwaukee Bucks. Six point game. And the pressure he put on that shot forced the miscue. Those are all the little things about effort there. He just gets out there and contests, and that's just enough. 
Now here's Williams. Still yet to score. And the rejection by Giannis! Beasley kicks to Lopez. Pass to Middleton. Inside. And there's Lopez. 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 This is by Middleton. This is by Lopez has got his second Chris Middleton. Feeling more and more comfortable in this offense. This is Chris Middleton making a play. To Rosen against Middleton. Back to White. Shoots over Lillard. Three points for Kobe White. Just reliable, guys. He's just always trying. Now Rosen with the assist. And with an update from the sidelines. Giannis on the move ball. Oh, I would love to see Giannis in the dunk contest. Wouldn't that be sweet? I don't know. Maybe sweet it is. <laughs> and great camera work showing up on the AT&T 5G Slam King. Here's White. Thank you. Kobe White. 11 points in the game. And boy, he's really in a groove. Dominant performance last game. Same thing this time out. Seems to be nobody in his way. No roadblocks for him to get to his Time out, Chicago Bulls. Continue to be aggressive. Big hops from the backcourt. <laughs> oh, absolutely. And maybe just what they need to get this game GA going in their direction. Defense has got to be better. Flat out effort was not there. Chicago calls timeout. Now, they're just trying to like keep them getting out of here, but just a finch out there. Giannis on a Kumpo, if he wouldn't be able to be in a slam dunk competition, you know, I would love to see how this guy does. Well, it may be one thing, well, you may never know what's going to happen like that. It's going to be a tough one to try to like keep it right at it. You may never know what's going to change like. And there might be one chance that you may never get there. So here are they. Just going to have to see what they are going to do for the 2024 All-Star. If there is going to be a lot of change off here, well, as you already noticed, that would, it would have been a next thing in the All-Star game, but we don't know where the next location will be because it might be one chance to another. Well, it might be saying you can't just let them get away with that. Now back to Kevin Harlan. Chicago Wiggins switch here. Caruso's checked in. New substitution on for the Chicago Bulls. Number six, Alex Caruso. Outside right. Middleton against Caruso. The Alex Caruso. Developed great floor vision. He doesn't miss the wide open man. Lillard dishes the Giannis. A touch over two and a half minutes of basketball played here in the third quarter. Hillary against White. Williams with the clock. There are ways to contribute that don't involve shooting the basketball. That's the best way. And maybe he can help them out in trying to win this game. Bucks trail by six. And here's Middleton. Six points for him. Can't cash in from close range. Williams passes to Vucevic. Shoots over Portis. Nikola Vucevic! Vucevic has got eight points. And with the ability to step out and make shots, bigs like Vucevic. Defense! Value. Defense! Yes. A shot by Middleton. Wide open. And again, the Bucks miss. And when you can't get anything to fall, it definitely gets in your head. Especially if you're a player that doesn't get a lot of shot attempts. But otherwise, the mindset is, I just got to get the next one to go. And you don't want to put that much pressure on yourself. Alex Caruso! So he's got the lead up to Nikola Gusevich. And when you're a high usage player like Gucevic, you have to keep your head up and be willing to make the next pass. Middleton with it. Now guarded by Vucevic. Full stop. Nikola Vucevic. There's his first stop. Small first team the drop. Team Third is Chris Middleton. And, and that is such a lot of for Milwaukee. Offense. Chris Middleton is the best line for two shots. They never force anything and always wait for the right shot. And when they get to those sweet spots, you can just count. Each one of them is capable of having that kind of night where it looks like the bucket is about five feet wide for them. A different look for Milwaukee. 
Your group substitution on Ford and Milwaukee and Bucks. Payne, number 15, Cameron Payne. And number 24, Pat Connaughton. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. And here are the Bulls now. And the side! Kobe! Starting to end. Oh, really Coaches always talk about the first five minutes of the third quarter. They have definitely increased their energy level here. He with it, points there. And again, the Bucks miss. And they've only got a slight edge on the boards, but it just feels a lot bigger. Caruso, bounce pass, tries from 16, and it's White missing. That might not be the shot they want him taking, even with the D backing off. Connaughton against Levine. Williams with the ball. Out of bounds. Milwaukee Bucks basketball. Bounds out of bounds, Bucks retain possession. So you got the Bucks. 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 Word of Bowles, number 12, comes Hayo Gossamu, and it's number five, Jevon Carter. Both champs checked in. And number three, Andre Drummond. And so it's Milwaukee now, trailing by 10. Here's Connaughton. Bucket is good. That Connaughton. Yeah. Here is Carter. Still scoreless. Two minutes remaining in the first quarter. Two minutes. Pass to Dosunu. Kicks it to Drummond. Here's Caruso. Doesn't go for him. Bucks trail by eight. Giannis outside. Powers the Giannis on the group. Not sure there are many players that can this match the physicality. Good job, Richard. And right here we're looking at Giannis out of the Kumbo. He's arguably the best player right now in the NBA. Not, not just the NBA, worldwide. That's a lot of space. <laughs> You're not wrong. He is the best two-way player in the league. Hey, oh, Dossimo! No other player can. Andre Drummond with the six. Very crispy here. He with it. On run. The pass to on the Kumbo. For Drummond and too long on the shot. And so is Drummond with it. He'll bring it up for the Bulls. They're leading by eight. Carter kicks to Drummond. It's a nice ball movement here by Chicago. Passes it to Carter. Shot clock at six. The wing jumper off target. Well, mid range is where he makes the money. So when the D's slow to get out on him, always surprising to see him miss. From there. Here's Kane. And then Chicago with the rebound. Now Drummond. Taking a look at his stance. He's averaging around seven and a half points a game. Good. Back trade. William. Chicago lead. And we're seeing some great fly the Dustin move. Loads it up for Yacht. There's Giannis on the Google. Yeah, you can throw that pass just about anywhere, even the top of the square, for Giannis to go and get. Here's Dosunmu, and the last shot before the first And that's the end of the first quarter. So it's the Chicago Bulls. Chicago Bulls, 54. You're lucky to box. 46. Great performance from the field. Back to the action in just a minute. We're getting close right now. Let's find out if the Bulls stay alive or Bucks take out the Bulls. Be back after this. It's go for a time. Let's make it happen. And a chance right now to show you our State Farm assist of the game. And I'm glad this was the pick because I love this pass. Such a great dish. That's what I call court vision. Well, a great job with the eyes. And what separates great playmakers, as we know, is peripheral vision. Fourth it's fourth quarter time. Let's get rolling. Bucks trail by eight. On the floor for Milwaukee, starting the fourth quarter. Beasley on the wing along with Middleton. 
Lopez is the pivot with Damian Lillard. Three points. You can't just stop when there's a pick set up. Got to fight over it as a defender. That's one that the coaches will watch tomorrow with that player. You hate to see him give up in that situation. To the middle, here's Lopez. Good. Group Lopez. He's a strong. Damian Lillard. Now in this one. Again and again, they're dissecting the defense and creating those high percentage looks from inside. The buck shooting from the field, 44%, not bad. Giannis with it. And Zach Levine gets the whistle. Eugene foul. Well, Zach Levine. That's his first foul. The That's his first foul. foul. First, first team foul. foul. Fourth quarter basketball, we're about a minute into it. Lopez passes to Lillard. Down and tries Damian to Lillard. Lillard. For his ninth bucket. He is 9 for 13 so far. Fundamental play there from Lopez spotting the open man and sending him the ball. Pass to Vucevic. Williams kicks to Vucevic. Pass to White. Offensive foul on the Bulls, Nikola Vucevic. He's done a good That's his job keeping control of the ball. Even with that turnover, you can tell his teammates trust him to hang on to the pill. The Hawks have gotten all three of their shots to drop here in the fourth quarter. They came out of the break on a roll. Three-pointer, Lillard. Here's Giannis. Down low. Giannis high to go. Could we say Time out. We should have a ball. In the first half because it seems to be a different guy out there, way more assertive. Time call here. The Bulls decide to talk it over. And they're allowing too many points in the paint. Coach is going to let them hear about it. Yeah, coach knows that. They know that. In the timeout, they're going to hear about it, make the adjustment. There's a lot of great percentage out there. Giannis on the Kubo bringing a team back up by one. He's looking for an hour block this time. Oh, we've got to watch out for now. You, you never know what's going to happen then. Because there's one way that a bunch of defender players are just going to take him inbound. Only Patrick Williams made a rejection. And there's your block on the other side. Looking to get more to tie that blocks in the game. We don't know. Well, as of me right now, this might be a chance if they can take it back to go with a full run marathon. The NBA on 2K Sports is brought to you by HT by G. Connecting changes everything. The fast, reliable, and secure. American Express. Don't live life without it. And by your local key dealers. The moment that inspires. With a short break in the action, gives us a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge. Hey Kevin, during that last break, I heard Billy Donovan talking to his team. Now he was quite encouraging in the huddle. He said, look, you're fighting out there, fellas. I can see it. I need you to keep giving everything we have. Bring this one home. See if they can pull it off. Guys. Thank you, David. He gets hey, Marty Rosen. So determined is the Rosen as he has piled up a ton of points to get this lead. Alert against White, fires from deep, and that's good. Damian Lillard, Lillard for, three. for three. Lillard's got 24 points. Well, he now has four three-pointers this game, guys, two in each half. He's really spacing out the floor for his teammates. Giannis against Williams. Here's Hansen to Kubo, and that one hits that guy. And so Levine will bring it up now for Chicago. And that one wow. 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 You love how they've lived in the paint, making the defense just consistently have to collapse and still finding ways to converse. And throughout the game, the mid-range area has been their bread and butter, continuing to pull up from there with a tremendous amount of confidence. 
And that one falls for White. You know, he's the biggest player right now, and this is where he has been determinizing, like, he was all played for once. And every time you play as a rookie, you rank up. And then for Kobe White, he got better at it, and he's looking to get in the starting group, and might find himself again, as he's looking for his first lead for tonight. And both free throws, good for White. And over two and a half minutes in the books here in the fourth. Middleton with it, now guarded by Vucevic. Fast break, here comes Chicago. Williams. Patrick Williams! Still a close game. Yeah, I'm making a lot of juicy bits for you six. One could come right down to the last shot. Defense! Middleton can't get it to go. Chicago leading. Those additions to Williams. It's White on the way. Outside Williams. White finds Williams. Terrific. Patrick Williams. All around. Kobe White with the assist. White's that new breed of combo guard who can do a little bit of everything. Trying to break that ice cold streak. Where's Middleton? By Middleton. Was the right call when, when you need a basket, go to the guys you trust the most. Yeah, whether it's teammates or the coaching staff, hopefully a combination of both. But it gets close, he's getting the ball. Here's Beasley and Levine with the block. And what a block from Levine! Love seeing him be so Bucks trail by four. Beasley kicks to Lilly. And he bets him in. Lillard's got 12 points in just the second half. Look at your watch. It's Lillard time. White against Lillard. On the wing of Bean. Good ball moving here by the Bulls. Over Beasley. And there's that living. From Nutri to Nutri for D6. Bucks have gone seven. Two friends. In the final quarter so far. Two friends. Solid looks for them. White against Willard. He kicks to Lopez. White with the rebound. Two minutes remaining in the fourth quarter. Two minutes. Outside the Rosen. And stolen by Lillard. And oh, here we go. Lillard's got it. The best great chance. Milton inside the three-point line. And it's pulled in by the bull. Vucevic has got nine rebounds in the game. Letting it down. Lopez has got four rebounds in this game. That is up top. Vucevic defending. Giannis Antetokounmpo. Again! Giannis Antetokounmpo is a star in this league. And more and more, the team trusts him in those moments. It's Levine. Good. Zach Levine! Williams has got three assists now in this one. Bucks trail by four. Defense! Defense! That is right, folks. Working on Williams. I did the combo. No good. And the effort never stops with him. No easy shots when he's on the floor. Well, it's about the defensive end, and that's what got his feet off. He gives the effort down there at all times. Absolutely critical chance right here. They need this one to go their way. Giannis Antetokounmpo. Within two points. This is about that one. Damian Lillard. I'm wondering if it's that. Timeout, Chicago Bulls. Chicago calls timeout. They lead by two. There's 37 seconds left in the game. This is 
is a close game matchup. Milwaukee trying to get back to the work here. Well, there might be one chains off. If they win again, then this is going to be a close call right in between. Oh, uh, I don't know if it might happen already. Well, it's going to be a lot of challenge defense. You're going to have to try to see what they can do if they can try to like put a snap at it. And then probably maybe it might be a one-way change to try to get from here. They got to do something else about them. They've got to go with the flow. It's a faster way, but let's see how this happens. If there's another chance to do this. Now, you saying that Billy Donovan has been going right from here in this scratch-off angle, you might have to look for himself if there is a good change-off that he needs to give him a switch again. Do this really have the cabin courtesy to get there? Well, there might be one way. Billy Donovan hasn't shown up anyway. Well, it's, it's a lot of courtesy to maintain it, and it's just a lot of hard responses. It can be a lot challenging if you're going to do it much more. Well, you may never guess it. It's going to be a difficult task to do the requirement. Now it's time for your New Balance player to game. Kevin, who do you have? And now let's present our New Balance player of the game. And to be the best part of the game has been the work he's done inside. I mean, slashing, driving the lane, attacking the basket at every chance. When he's had an opening, he's taken it. All right, team, let's get your hands up. I want to hear Vince and I. Let's go, Bull. We expect to see him slow it down now. Yeah, I think you want to milk your possessions. Outside DeRozan. The feed to Vucevic. The kick out to Williams. And the pass to White. Find the shoot. Fires the three. Milwaukee with the rebound. Ryan Kubo finds Willard. To take the lead. Oh, the oh. And that's their game! Final score tonight. Chicago Bulls 68. And Milwaukee Bucks 66. Feels so great to win. It's like a knife in the gut to lose. Uh, you you got to love being on the edge of your seat and just wondering what's going to happen. How is this thing going to play out? And now we'll send it over to David Aldridge, who is standing by courtside. David. Thanks very much, Zach. Some big baskets for you down the stretch. What's it like when you have the ball in your hands in those moments? Oh, it was great. I'm not scared to take or miss any shot, you know, and, uh, you know, I'll go down there swinging every time. Well, you connected at the right time tonight, man. Congrats. Back to you. Thank you for that, David. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For Greg Anthony, Brett Perry, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan. Thank you for watching the NBA, presented by 2K Sports. So long, everyone. And for Terry Crews, along with Cool Beast, see you next time. Time for Son of Beast for the Post Game Show. All for you. All right, Terry, thank you so much. A disappointing effort right now as the upset brings up for Chicago Bulls to shut them down on Milwaukee Bucks. This was an upset of the game as for Milwaukee Bucks, they lost their streak again. That is the second time in the season after from season three, nope, season five, that was happened to be one of them. Only fourth season wrote with a win. And for the other side of the team, it was a disaster for this part of the season. An unbelievable moment. You can't be realizing how this happened. A lot of steals has been coming in with the blockness. Looks like there's another change that could try to keep it out. Well, on this point, this was a fan favorite of the Bucks and the Bulls, the series showdown state of the Central Division. Well, in that case, we finally have a great enough to show how loved we all have the courtesy to take all for a moment. I do for everything. Here's how you did with the total statistic games. 53% for their field goals for the Chicago. Four three-pointers were made here in between those two. Free throws, fast break points, points in paint, and second chance points was picked up for Milwaukee Bucks. They're starting to come in that point. They might be going for it again. Bench points was 13 and 22 assist run with Chicago Bulls. 
Offensive rebound was played up for Milwaukee with 10. 28 defensive rebounds for Chicago. There are only 4 steals and 5 blocks. Only 1 turnover has turned. 2 team fouls and 4 dunks were performed for Milwaukee Bucks. And for the other side, the biggest lead was Chicago Bulls 10 and time possession was 14-18. And they only had 2 timeouts remaining for Milwaukee Bucks if they decided to call for it. Well, they should call for timeout actually, like, because if they don't do it, then unfortunately enough, they got no time to waste and they should have been able to call the timeout at that point. But it's too late now, it's uh, definition to be out of here, just over and under. So that will do here for this game. Time to present your three star players of the game. Wood Spoonie, take it here. Thank you, Mike. As right now, we start off with your third star of the game. We're going to start big right in between to Zach Lavine. He just delivered it with a two dunk performance, 15 performance run, 7 out of 8, 1 3 pointer. Cole Pollock's up to score 15 points, 4 rebounds, and a block made. That is a Echoball run of the Epic Score Ville Voyage of the Term team to break things on. Your second star player of the game goes to Damian Miller with 26 points, 3 rebounds, 4 assists, and 1 steal. Only have 1 dunk and 34 performance run was the best to buy. Just all it does turn out without the Trailblazers, the new dynamic trios are just coming in hot. In between with Chris Middleton and Giannis Antetokounmpo. And your first star player of the game for a new balance, it goes to Kobe White, the veteran of New York Carolina. 13 points, 3 rebounds, and an incredible 8 assist in the game. He did great just to keep up with eyes on a perspective run. Looks like he's doing really well to keep them out of here. And just only 30 performance run. 5 out of 13 field goals and 1 free pointers. Well, that was an excellent one, and thank you so much, Sir Wood Spoonie. Uh, my pleasure, Mike. In the meantime, that concludes game number 12, as we will be stepping things up to game 13 to have the rally out before the NBA playoffs begins after the play in tournament, because we're getting a little bit of approachment down here. Just a couple months left. And we will be seeing what goes on here. And exactly what I call for you. Just keep it eyes on here. The All-Star game, terrific, excellent. It's a great battle between. In the meantime, with me, Son of Beast, and Wood Spoonie, this has been a presentation of the NBA on 2K Sports. Look for more games coming underway along with the Rival Week and the NHL games on EA Sports. In the meantime, peace out folks for a while as the NBA on 2K Sports Style. And I'll see you all again for the next video of the game. And a skit will be releasing soon, so hopefully in that occasionally, uh, if you enjoyed it, this is um, definitely the hardest part to go with the line, but it's all that it does turn out. But the new skit will be releasing soon, so you'll find out soon enough. In the meantime, I'm out of here. Good night, everybody. And from the Chicago line of the town. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.